Hello, seniors. Mrs. Hetzel here coming at you today uh, with just a quick check-in. Uh, felt I hadn't had any face-to-face -face time with you guys lately. Um, Want to get you some more feedback and stuff through videos. Uh, but for today, I thought I would do an introductory video uh, with me. So hi, it's good to see you. Um, really just wanted to compliment you guys and just let you know how proud of you I was for uh, how hard you've been working through this Hamlet unit. Uh, Hamlet is usually the unit in English 12 where seniors start to feel um, their senioritis kick in. And you guys have done a really good job of uh, communicating your needs to me, letting me know what's going on in your world, and setting deadlines for yourself uh, and working through a little bit of, you know, just some flexible school nature stuff. So um, you guys have been doing a really great job and I'm really proud of you. Um, so I wanna make you aware that this week you do have your final exam for Hamlet. Uh, excuse me, I have kind of a cold, so. And this week you, I'm presenting a whole bunch of just re, um, kind of summarization, help you review uh, materials for the Hamlet test. Now, this test is a big deal. It's uh, it's worth a lot of points in your grade book. And quite frankly, we haven't had a real big test like this in this class yet. Um, so this will be your first interaction with um, one of my exams. Um, and I really just wanna give you the best chance to do your very best. Uh, this exam is going to be a proficiency exam. And what that means is if you don't pass the exam, I'm going to be reaching out to you and uh, working with you one-on-one -on -one to help you understand the areas of the exam that you were getting wrong um, to make sure that we're meeting the standards and benchmarks that we need for this class. So just be aware that if you don't pass it, that I will be in touch and that's not a bad thing. Uh, and if you are reviewing and you have any questions about the play, please feel free to reach out to me at any point. Um, and then the last thing I wanted to let you guys know for this week was um, in unit four, we are going to be reading our science fiction books. So much fun. Um, you have the choice between Anne Rand's Anthem George Orwell's 1984, Aldous Huxley's Brave New World, or Ray Bradbury's Fahrenheit, uh, Fahrenheit 451. Uh, you will need to get a copy of these books. If you would like support in trying to find a digital copy and or a PDF of the book or even an audio book, please reach out to me and let me know. Uh, I'm going to be working over the next couple of days uh, and putting together some resources for the reading unit for us. Um, but if you can try to get a hold of a book or start looking for how you are going to read it on either your Kindle or on your phone, are you going to use the computer, or do you want an actual physical book? Um, most of these books are very available at libraries, although you won't be able to write in them. You could do sticky note uh, annotations throughout them. So just a heads up that we have this book unit coming up. And then one last message to those of you that maybe aren't doing so awesome in the course. Um, please remember that I am always available to support you and that we have other interventions and ideas that we could work through and talk through uh, to hopefully get you closer to passing. Um, and always reach out to me if you are struggling. And for everyone, don't forget Unit 3's final deadline is November 19th at 11.59 uh, p.m. and the, the uh, grade book will close to any late or revised uh, work that you want to resubmit. Um, so that's on November 19th coming, coming up in a couple weeks. So um, I think that's all I have for you guys today. Uh, it was great to have a little bit of video time and we'll talk soon. Reach out to me if you have any questions. Thanks kiddos. Bye.